Good morning. This is Don from the Don Outdoors. I'm doing my preparation and training for the Appalachian Trail. I am actually in the Cape Fear region of North Carolina, which is pretty close to the uh, ocean. I am walking one of the trails near my house. I've been doing about three miles a day. I'm going to my uh, four miles a day. Um, see if I could do it. My pack is weighing about 27 and a half pounds. I actually got a military pack on me, but um, I should be getting my uh, Z packs arc haul in real soon, and I'll be working with that. Um, yeah, so I'm really excited about this upcoming uh, Appalachian Trail hike from Springer Mountain, Georgia all the way up to Katahdin, Maine. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and start at the uh, the falls, uh, walk up the, the steps. A lot of people tell me don't do it, but I'm gonna go ahead and do it from the, the steps and then go all the way up. My start date is gonna be April 6th. That's when I'm leaving. And um, I'll go ahead and start from there, but I'm not gonna rush. I'm, there's no reason for me to rush. If I get two miles done that day, I get two miles. If I get five miles done that day, I'll get five miles. But I got to be there before October at Katahdin, Maine. That's my ultimate goal. Um, so I am prepping. As you saw, I did a little exercise. Uh, I love to stretch out before I go uh, on my walks. Um, if not, my back will hurt me. So right now I've been testing my this military pack out for a couple of days and uh, it hasn't bothered me too much yeah I actually i've been doing pretty good with it also the um problem with me is i have a pacemaker and so the strap goes a little bit over the pacemaker but you know you just got to suck it up sometimes uh i'm not going to stop i'm going to attempt it my wife says yeah you're going to attempt it but i'm going to actually keep on going until i can't go no more uh I'm so excited about this trip. I saw Miss uh, Hiking Dancer the other day go up the steps in some high-rise building. Boy, <laughs> that's motivating. Uh, good job and um, hope to see you on the trail. And everyone from Class 2022, I hope to see you on the trail also. This is uh, for me, a bit exciting because I spent a lot of years in uh, the military and public service. And now it's all about me. I would love for my wife to go with me, but right now she has other obligations and she can't. So I am gonna go ahead and take this trip on my own. Um, as you see, this trail here is a beautiful trail. I know it's flat, but it's still something to give me a couple of miles in. I know some of you all are gonna say, that's only four miles, but for me, I'm happy with that. I'm gonna go up fifth, six miles, but as long as I do it every, day or every other day i'm happy with it um, i've done a lot of hiking all over the world but uh, i've never done something so long uh, i think the longest i've done is three days to tell you the truth this morning it's about 39 degrees uh, so a nice cool day but with this pack it keeps me a little bit warm because you're exerting energy and it warms up my body so I'm doing pretty good right now but I'm so inspired by so many people there are a, a lot of hikers that uh, have went before me and uh, have set the example I've always enjoyed hiking and I uh, wish my wife could go with me but like I said she has other obligations and um, I promised her when we get back though I'll go somewhere nice with her uh, we do want to do the Mont Blanc tour but my focus right now is to go ahead and get the um, Appalachian Trail completed so for most of you what I'm trying to do every day is get up in the morning uh, 
get my good cup of coffee and stretch out, put the backpack on and just start walking. Stick to my channel. You'll see a lot of interesting things. Uh, I'm 55 years old. I'm still a young man. Just retired three weeks ago, which is outstanding. Uh, spent many, many years, like I said, in public service. Uh, financially, thank God I saved up for this. I'm buying the latest equipment, lightweight equipment. Um, utilizing uh, z packs a lot i'm going to be ordering their tent their sleeping bag system their backpack uh, my shoes i'm a danner fan i love danners so i'll be utilizing danners and then uh patagonia and believe it or not 511 i got some 511 equipment on me um I'll be doing a gear review of everything that I'll be taking on the Appalachian Trail uh, in about a week or so. I should have all of my equipment in by then. Uh, my wife, one thing good about that is she's going to go ahead and be my support system. She will go ahead and meet me in different locations um, so she could do resupply. And also I'll be sending some stuff via the mail to some of the uh, points. Uh, and then hydration is another thing that I'm really big on I got a water bottle on me and that's real big then I have a water bottle on my truck but hydrating yourself is so important yeah I'll be trying to take two systems with me I'm gonna take the Sawyer um, filtration system and also the be free uh, I know it's ridiculous but I want to make sure if something goes wrong with one I got a backup for the other Um, also, if you have any comments or suggestions, um, anything that could assist me, like I said, I've never done this before. This is going to be new to me, a long journey. So if you have anything that's going to help me on this, uh, trail, please just send a comment on my, uh, YouTube channel, the Dawn Outdoors. Uh, I'm going to need all the help. Uh, I'm just wanting to do my best on this trail. I'm wanting to make sure that I succeed.